Hey guys, welcome to my um, July TBR pile video where I'll be talking about the books that I'm going to hopefully read for the month of July. I've got a bunch of books, around 13 books, 12, 13, so hopefully I will be able to read them this month. First book that I already read, so yay for that, is Judy Picoult and Samantha Van Leer's Between the Lines. This book is a fantasy book and that is all we'll be talking about. I will discuss it more in the wrap-up. Then um, right now I'm reading Fury by Elizabeth Miles. This book is paranormal slash contemporary and it says here Revenge is Sweet. Um, I will also be reading the second book in the series which is Envy by Elizabeth Miles also and it says here they'll get what they want. So it's, it's, it's kind of like a bit creepy. I've, I've read reviews and everyone says it's like creepy but in like in a good way. So yeah, and this book comes out in September so I've got a lot of time. But I'm hoping to read that too this month. Also, another book that already came out is um, Zoe Letting Go by Nora Price. So I'm going to hopefully be reading that one next after Fury. Also, Don't Breathe a Word by Holly Coppola. I've had this on my shelf for too long. And um, my like one of my summer resolutions for this year is to read as many um, non-review books as possible. And right now I've read um, five or six just for June. So, um, so I'm hoping to read like a bit, like three or four for this month. So yeah, just, you know, narrow, you know, to narrow down my, um, reading pile. Um, also another non-review book I'll be reading is Glimmer by Phoebe Catanidis. And this book talks about a girl and a guy who suddenly wake up, um, and not knowing where they are or who they are or anything. And they have to rely on people to figure out who they are, but then there's this huge mystery that they have to, that they have to, un, um, unravel and like basically um, find out and stuff so it's pretty interesting it's like mystery with um, you know memory loss and stuff and it's just exactly the type of book the type of book that I like so yeah another book that I've been dying to read and finally got is Cold Fury by T.M. Uh, Goglin sorry for that pronunciation I know it's horrible the cover is awesome I've had this on my wish list for the longest time and it comes out in July, so, um, yeah, so um, I'm so excited to read this one. Also, another book is The Unnaturalists by Tiffany Trent, and um, this book is steampunk, steampunk, and I haven't read a lot of steampunk books, books, I don't know what's wrong with my pronunciation, but yeah, I haven't read a lot of steampunk books, so, um, yeah, this is gonna be um, a, a good, you know, um, break from my usual reads. Also, I will be reading Wake by Amanda Hawking, and I have not read her trill trilogy or whatever they say it. So, um, this sounds interesting, and yeah, it comes out in August, end of August, so I've got time to read that. Also, I will be reading some galley books, not e galley books. And first one is Don't Turn Around by Michael Gagnon and the um I've heard the best things about this book and I cannot wait to read it. It's like sort of like hacking with this girl who's on the run and then she gets recruited by this hacking uh, company or whatever and um, everyone says it's amazing so I'm really pumped up to read this one. Another book that I'll be reading is Confessions of an Angry Girl by Loy Rosette. And a lot of people tell me um, I have a temper. I kind of do. I know I do. So I'm hoping that I can, you know, see, relate to her. I'm pretty sure I will. And here it says, so what if she has anger issues? You would too. But yeah, can't wait to read this one. The cover is cute. Another book that I'll be reading, hopefully, is Innocent Darkness, which is book number one in the Aether Chronicles by Suzanne uh, Lazier. So yeah, this is another steampunk. So two steampunks in one month just to, to you know to know whether I actually really do enjoy this genre and to continue reading and not reading it or to just be like yeah it's just not a genre for me like sci-fi another book is Defiance by C.A. C.J. Redwine I've only heard good things about this book and it is paranormal and the cover is gorgeous so yeah I'm definitely gonna read this one and yeah these are all the books, and um, there are a lot, but um, I have a lot of review books to go through, so 
can't really do anything about them, but I'm happy for them because I love reading books like everyone else. I don't know what I'm saying. But okay, so these are all the books. Um, hope you guys um, enjoy your um, um, reading for the month of July. And if you guys have your TBR videos, link me below. And um, if you've read any of the books that I have not read, um, just tell me um, how good they are and stuff, and which books I should read first, blah, blah, blah and stuff like that. And again, I'm really sorry for not being able to read Meg Cabot's um, Underworld. I know I promised I will, but I forgot. I'm really sorry. It's because I've been traveling for the past two weeks, so I haven't settled down for a while, and um, I will be reading it in this month. Sure, that just popped up in my head. So I will be reading McCabot's Underworld for sure. Okay, guys? So that's it, and um, have a nice day. Bye, guys.